Hey loves, how are you guys doing? Welcome to a new vlog. Um, today I'm just going to be taking you guys with me for an event. YSL is hosting us for a little party. I think they're launching a new fragrance, but I'm not too sure. Um, they didn't really say in the email, but I do believe it's a new fragrance. But yeah, so I'm going to be taking you guys with me. Um, we'll be getting ready. I have to just re-glue, well, re-spray some parts of my hair and then shower do my makeup choose my outfit i'm having some issues picking out an outfit though i don't know what to wear i have this um what is this called corset top from zara i really like this and i feel like this just gives like ysl vibes because ysl is very edgy type vibe or i have this other corset um kind of similar as well but just a different color i just don't know what to like pair it with like on the bottom maybe i could possibly do jeans like actual like denim but then i don't know like i'm trying to look cute i was actually also thinking to just wear a dress because that's just like my my default when i don't know what to wear i just look for a dress and i know that my outfit is complete i have this other like corset top thing so it's like not top but this is the skirt and it has a matching top that's the exact same print and i was saving this for like a brunch you know outing and stuff but i just i didn't end up going anywhere so i'm like should i just wear it tonight you know save myself the stress i think i'll just wear this tonight to be honest because i don't have the energy oh i have this skirt here like this is giving very much party vibes gonna grab all of my hair tools and time to style my hair all right, so I just replaced my wig. Um, I still have to straighten it. So I'll just take a shower and then straighten it. I don't know. I just feel like if I straighten it and then shower, it would like revert. I don't know why, but yeah. So I'm gonna just shower first and then straighten the hair. All right, so we are moisturized. Um, my room is so messy in the background. Please ignore that. But I'm just gonna do like a light beat. Um, Nothing too serious, just kind of like my go-to look. My friend will be here in exactly 20 minutes. I feel like this event will be fun. Thank God, the weather is actually not bad today. So wherever you are, how's your summer been? Here in Toronto, like our summer has been, it honestly hasn't really been like proper summer. Like we only had a few proper hot days. We didn't even have heat waves like that. I think it was only maybe three heat waves the whole summer, which is, interesting but like it just was not as hot and i'm sure a lot of it is because we've been having a lot of forest fires like in british columbia area so i'm sure like nature is trying to balance itself out or something i don't know i don't know what'll be going on but there's been a lot of rain and just like weird weather you know i don't want to be complaining but you know thank god anyways we're alive Oh, I have some products I actually I picked up from Sephora that I want to try out. This is one of them too, but um, I've had this for a while now. As you can see, the bottle is already it's pretty much done. <laughs> I put it in my kit. I, I have like four different setting sprays I use on my clients. It's kind of crazy. When I do the Amico, they literally take a shower once we're done. Like with all the setting sprays I use. Milk primer, just to prime the skin. This works well for me. Um, with my skin type you guys know I'm combination skin now if you didn't know now you know combination skin so my t-zone kind of gets oily shiny the rest of my face is a little bit dry probably dehydrated so this primer is good because it hydrates the skin foundation we're using NARS so I mix Macau and Muria 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 that kind of gives me like my perfect shade is it really perfect though but make it work maria is very yellow macau is more so on the neutral side so if you see my skin tone like i'm like golden neutral i'm not like super duper olive golden um yeah and i'm not super neutral as well so that's why i mix the two of them together and this just gives like good coverage as well which is also why i like it so Let's, let's do a quick reveal. 
Yo, I get so nervous taking off the band sometimes because I'm just like, bruh, this thing should just fall my hand. Look at this already. I seen one girl's video on TikTok where she took off her band and the entire week came off with it. I'm just like, what happened, sis? So every single time I'm taking off my band, I literally think about that video. <laughs> to contour, I'm using Too Faced Born This Way Concealer in the shade Toffee. I really like this color for contouring. It's not too dark for me. It still has the golden undertone. So whenever I'm doing faces, like from contour to highlight to powders i like everything i like everything to be like to match the undertone of the person right um so if the person is golden like i am all of it will be golden from powders all of that everything will be golden because i feel like that just gives more of like a very seamless finish then i'm going in with warm sand also by Too Faced. This is my highlight color. I will still go in with like a lighter color. Same warm sand shade. And I'm just going to be popping that just using that to clean my brows. I like to blend out the contour first and then blend the highlight. I don't know, I just feel like it looks nicer. All these things really could be in my head. You know, you know how we just kind of have our thoughts on things, especially if it's something we've been doing in a particular way for a while. We're just like, oh, well, okay, I guess that just works. just came so I just finished my makeup this fan I bought from Amazon one of my very best purchases is so good so good so convenient too all right so I'm gonna go and quickly style my hair change my outfit and then we're good to go Jack come and say hi girl change my outfit. come say hi come say hi come say hi oh hi Hey vlog. Look at my fine babe. Look at my fine. Look at Toronto's favorite MUA YouTuber. Hey, most impressive model. <laughs> so we're going together. I'm so excited. It's gonna actually be a great time. I can already tell. Yeah, it's gonna be bad. We'll see. We'll see. I'm good. Don't mind my shoes right now. Hmm. We're going to the car. I mean, we can't see the shoes. We can't see the shoes, but we see the rest of the outfit. Hey, oh, a little extra. You have a jacket. That's a good idea. It was okay. It was a little burst outside, but you know. It's cool, eh? Boss here. It's cold. I'm so, so mad. Sad. <laughs> this is my twin, y'all. Like, ying and yang. <laughs> Always on my face. Can you imagine us <laughs> matching? I love I love both wearing corsets. Like, I love skirt. We knew. Yeah. We knew. Yeah. Is this Nicki Minaj on this song? Nicki Minaj. No lotto. You didn't hear the remix? Why? She did. Listen to the whole thing. It's bad. We'll talk to you when we're there. Security guard, sorry. We're security. I'm trying to blend 
in, everybody, black, 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 give in, give in, <laughs> give in, fine, babes. <laughs> So I'm back home now. Honestly, the event was just okay. I'm just happy like I got to see like familiar faces and just, you know, whenever you see people you know, you just kind of make the best out of <laughs> whatever situation is there. It makes it a little bit easier. But yeah, nothing to write home about, but it's okay. So I'm going to just take off my makeup. I'm going to wash my face and then we'll do a little like skincare or get on ready with me type of video once I'm done. Alright, so I have washed my face. Please ignore my lace. <laughs> but this is a quick nighttime routine. I'm not gonna talk through it, I'll just play music just so it's nice and relaxing for you all. I want to get to know